Mankind needs more and more energy, but how can it be obtained without destroying the Earth? Scientists worldwide are looking for answers, and in their search, they have high hopes of utilizing the oceans as a source of clean energy. However, the necessary technology is only just being developed. It's estimated that the oceans could meet at least 12% of the world's energy needs. The big advantage of using seawater to generate electricity is that it is available in infinite quantities and involves no carbon dioxide emissions. One reason researchers are focusing on waves as a source of power is that they are capable of transporting energy around the globe. Every wave starts off small. At first, as a mere ripple on the surface, then mini waves catch the wind like sails. They absorb its energy and steadily grow in size. However, it is not the water itself that travels, but the energy contained in it. The particles of water themselves merely move up and down. And it's this up and down motion that is the focus of attention here in northern Scotland. Named Pelamis after a species of sea snake, this red metallic structure is designed to generate electricity. The concept was devised back in the 90s at Edinburgh University by mechanical engineer Richard Yem. Pelamis is designed to adapt to the natural movement of water at the surface. Flexibly interlinked, the metal tubes move rhythmically up and down. Cylinders in the power modules between the long floats absorb the movement of the hinged joints. With enormous pressure, they pump hydraulic fluid into a receptacle and thus drive a generator. <laughs> 